Also across the nation, Academy Awards Sunday night. They're right here on ABC, uh, on 13 Wham TV, excuse me. And this morning, we've got a couple of previews. First from the producers of the show itself. Norma Holland talked to Bill Mechanic and Adam Shankman, and they were joined by the star of one of the most nominated films this year, Avatar's Sigourney Weaver. Here's that interview. Thank you, Sigourney <laughs> and Bill and Adam. How are you? Good. Yeah, very well. How are you? We're warmer than you. <laughs> Not yes, likely. You, you are. You are very much warmer. Yeah. We're just starting to uh, get a little bit of a melt here in Rochester. Yeah. Isn't it, starting to, isn't it starting to get warmer now? Yeah, like in the mid 30s instead of you know zero. Ooh. So we're good. We're good. Uh, well, oh, 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 put on your bathing suit. <laughs> Monday night. Monday, we're coming to you then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shorts okay. and a tank top. Oh, don't even blow, joke. We were joking about that today. There are people who wear, who wear shorts and T-shirts in this type of weather. But let's get uh, started. So, ooh. okay, this year, um, Bill and Adam, you're producing, co-producing the show, right? Correct. Correct. It's a first for both of you. Um, Correct. What kind of nervous, what kinds of weight on your shoulders do you feel with the production of this uh, caliber? Imagine, imagine trying to carry around the Empire State Building. And, for five months. Yeah. And I would say that right now, none. <laughs> I'd say right now, it's, I'd say right now, none. I feel like we have put five months of really like yeah. dedication or really, you can't think about it more or live it more or breathe it more. And, and at this stage, it's execution and, and you have to trust the movie gods. Uh, but, but yeah, absolutely. But neither of us have basically slept in a month. And, mm -hmm. uh, and I know for myself, uh, I've been, I've literally were just running on adrenaline because of the anticipation of it. I mean, it is literally the biggest night for our industry of the year. Right. So and there's no pressure I, at all. Yeah, there's really no pressure. Um, and you know yeah. that Rochester is the uh, is the home of uh, Eastman Kodak Company, which of That's course yes, that is correct. Kodak Theater. Um, Sigourney, I have to say, it's an honor to talk to you. Of course, uh, oh, Avatar you. nominated for nine. Uh, nine uh, Academy Awards. This is huge. I saw the film in 3D, and I just couldn't get over the special effects. I mean, they were incredible. Um, just the whole concept of the movie. What was it like to be a part of something, you know, kind of harkening back to your early days in film, you know, very sci-fi? Well, it was very exhilarating. Jim Cameron is an amazing showman and director. It was a great story, great cast. Um, we're thrilled to be one of the ten movies that are nominated. The, the movies this year are also excellent, even though they're all different sizes, shapes, stories. Yeah. And, um, you know, we certainly represent the, the bigger movie on that end of the spectrum, but, but it's, it's thrilling to be <laughs> on the same sort of lineup with Precious and, and Serious Man and all these other great movies that I assume have come to Rochester and that you've seen them, but they're, it's really an exciting year. Yeah, there are 10 films nominated for Best Picture for That's the first correct. time since 1943. Yeah. Um, why is that? Was that a decision that was made just because there were so many great pictures or um, was no. there another reason? Well, there was originally 10, and, and I think the idea from the Academy, it's not our choice. So the Academy wanted to um, broaden the appeal. The, you know, I think it's gotten narrow over the last few years, and, and so they wanted a wider range of pictures. There's no guarantee that it would have been a wider range of pictures, but yeah. um, it, the Academy itself embraced it, and, and you have movies from Blind Side to um, a Serious Man. So. Uh, and, and then ironically, and they're all great films. Yeah, and ironically, the last, um, the, the biggest ratings the show I think had ever gotten, or is that, was the the Titanic one. Biggest which, one since, since in the last 20 years. Yeah. Since the last 20 years, which Bill oversaw and Jim made. Mm -hmm. So this is like, it's, a, it's just, very, it's all like history hopefully repeating very itself. It's really, very synchronous. Yes, there's a lot of synchronicity. To yeah. it. Yes. Um, Sigourney, the film got so many um, accolades, just of course uh, from, from the technical aspect, but also from its message, which really struck a chord with a lot of people. Um, there were, for some reason, people really paid attention to what the film was about, not just what it looked like. Uh, how gratifying is that to you as an, as an actor to hear that people are actually listening to the message? Well, I think that was a very important part of the theme for Jim. And, uh, you know, I think Fox every now and then would say, you know, there's a lot of tree hugging, and Jim would say, and I am a tree hugger. <laughs> and so I think that because people are universally concerned around the globe about um, what's happening to our forests, to our uh, all these different wonderful species on Earth, you know, uh, I think that it really touched a chord. And um, I think that all of the movies this year actually are, are have very 
uh, important themes, you know, District 9, another fascinating sci-fi picture up in the air about, you know, being disconnected, you know, precious, uh, you know, I just think it's such a banner year uh, and I'm so proud to be in an industry, frankly, that's turning out stories that have this kind of depth and perception in them. That's great yeah. and, and like you said, there's so many different kinds uh, nominated we for Best Picture. We, we actually have a, a saying that we use, we've used around the show, which is big is not inherently bad and small is not inherently good. It's uh -huh. just good is good and bad is bad and we're represented this year, we're uh, representing yeah, everything. I like that. I will say, yeah, and I will say that one of the things, there's been a lot of complaints in past years about how, oh, Hollywood's not turning out any good movies anymore, you know, no, you know and the, the rise of the independent and all of that. Well, I've heard none of that. Mm -hmm. Suddenly, do you know what I mean? That that mm -hmm. talk. Now, of course, it'll it could come sure. back next year. But but you know, certainly this year, okay. Hollywood mm -hmm. seems to have gotten it right. All right, and that's yeah. and hopefully you'll get some sleep after all of this. Thank you. Uh, uh, I, I, don't, I don't remember what that is. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bill and Adam. Have a great show. Congratulations. Good luck. Okay. Thank Enjoy you. the Thank show. You. Thank we you. We will stay warm.